sua façade think he is impertinence like that earns him a good flogging <laughs> he's lucky he lives in modern times today's penalties for heresy are not what they should be i think jekyll overdoes all this stuff about helping the poor i've been seeing james all my life and i've never seen a poor person well i think he's mad if you must know <laughs> oh danvers we were just talking about your future son-in-law and I think you're mad to allow him to marry your daughter. That's not father's decision, Lady Beaconsfield. It's mine. Don't worry, Bessie. What are your views of him as a scientist? Him assures me that he's impeccable husband material. It's less than impeccable to be late for one's own engagement party. Shows a remarkable lack of style. Comments on style, madame, should never be made by those who have none. My dear madam, you're so gracious to wish Henry and Emma both well. My dear Bessie, as you know well, I wish Emma the sun and the moon, but I have to confess that I wish Henry Jekyll in hell. Emma Danvers, forgive me. Nothing to forgive, dear boy. How's it inviting the guests after the wedding so you can appear to be on time? Sir Danvers, my lords, ladies and gentlemen, to the intolerably happy couple, Henry, may your research result in a discovery as wonderful as this one. To Emma and Henry. To Emma and Henry. 
Miss Carew. Dr. Jekyll, I'm happy you're here. I try never to miss any social occasions attended by Leader Beaconsfield. Is there a Lord Beaconsfield? He died 30 years ago. Sensible fellow. You know, Henry, I sometimes wish you were as diplomatic as you are outspoken. I'll be outspoken if you'll be diplomatic. If you have presented my case today to the Board of Governors, I probably would have got what I wanted. You'll get what you want in the end, Henry. You always do. I don't have a choice. I must go on with the work I'm committed to. How can I not when my theories are true? And I will prove if I'm ever permitted to. Things are not wrong just because they are new. Henry, I adore you, always have and always will do. And your dreams are mine. I will always understand, however hard the path you've planned, our lives will intertwine. Who knows where my work will lead me? Oh, where, where you will not need me? Emma, please, I beg you, heed me. Just don't leave me on my own. The only thing to fear is the unknown.